Saga, Nakakigil, Beauty Motalaga, the same Ben Diamond here, Ben Diamond, boxing commentator, KO Boxing on Fox Sports, Racing Crown Bet. Both fighters weighed in right on the featherweight limit, 57 kilograms even. 10 by 3 minute rounds of international boxing in the featherweight division. Would you welcome in the blue corner from Montin Lupa, Metro Manila in the Philippines. Coach Dante Santos El Mario. He tipped the scales last night at 57 kilograms even, as I said. 27 years of age, 23 fights, 16 wins, 7 losses. Would you welcome a man with the same name as the Russian president? No connection there. Virgil Putin with gold and red trunks. And across the ring in the red corner with a great Yarraville following here tonight. Working out with former national champ Lim Checker in Hyde Street, Yarraville. 11 fights, 10 wins, only one loss. London Olympian 2012 has held Australian Super Bantamweight and Featherweight Championships. Part of a great fighting family. Ladies and gentlemen, wearing black trunks with sponsors' names. Would you welcome La Bala, Ibrahim Bala. Your referee, Ignatius Misalaitis. 10 rounds of boxing, international. Cracker, La Bella, Ibrahim Bella, back at the Melbourne Thank you, Troy. Thank Park you Function us. Centre. Against tough puncher, Virgil Puton. Yep, 16 wins, 7, there was a nice jab from Bella. 16 wins, 7 losses. Put us out the Turek in the West. KO, so he can, got a bit of kick in his fist as well. Just yeah. a nice, uh, just at the... Both Ibrahim and uh, Camille Bala have been over training at Allah Gym. Uh, if they are watching the link over there, uh, Sir Allah, Dido Edmund, and all the boys at Allah Gym, hello from Melbourne, Australia. Um, here we are, La Bala, Ibrahim Bala. Nice left hand against Poots on there. Oh, a nice left hook there from Puton. He's got to Puton watch that. Puton can Ibi bang Bella. a bit. He's got to watch that left hook, Ibi Bella. Get a nasty one from Neil John Tabernow a couple of fights ago. He doesn't want to repeat of that. That's correct. Good jab again from Ibi nice Bella. But right caught with a little right, right hand and got caught from, with an uppercut. From, uh, oh, oh, good left hook nice. from Bella. Nice rip to the body from Puton, but what a left hook back from Bella, yes. Yeah. Right into the body nice. from... Uh, Puton left hook the head from Bella. Nice oh. chopping right there from uh, Puton. Puton's right hand did a bit of damage there, I think. He's got yeah. that's better to see Ibrahim, Ibrahim there using his defensive skills. That's right. To yeah. get out of trouble. Let's not forget he's a 2012 Olympian, about an eight-time Australian amateur champion. He'd be Bella. Great, great boxing skills. Sometimes we start knocking these guys over. You have a tendency to forget that you're in there to box. It's not just to be a puncher. So. Um, they I all think get he's learned from the Tabernow fight. Well, yes. Well, I've got, got a saying, nice. if, you, if, you don't, if you don't win in boxing, you learn. Yep. Either that or give it away. Yep. Nice, nice right, right hand. Counter. Beautiful stuff from Ibi Bala. Then a left oh, into the body. body shot. Right to the head. Opening up a bit there. One thing about these Filipino boys, they are tough. They don't come over here. You know, I hate to hear this term, taxi drivers and stuff, talk about some of the Thai fighters. Some of the great Thai fighters don't actually get to come over here because their money's too good. But, you know, when you're bringing boxers yeah, up, you, you, you don't put them in against the best fighters in the world. You test them and bring them up a little bit at a time. 
We come to the stage of guys like this, like Tavernier. These guys are punches, as um, as we saw what happened uh, Ten seconds. in America. Well, Chimpa Gonzalez getting stopped uh, by Roman Duno last week, which was a big upset for the WBC youth title. Round one. Round one. Yes, I'm saying both Ibu and Camille had a, had a two, three-week training sparring camp. Nice overhand, right? So they've been sparring tough guys like this at, uh, at uh, I can't say exactly where. There's many other gyms in the Philippines, but uh, let's just say they were at one of them. So, uh, yeah, they've been sparring with some good quality boys, so uh, they're well-tuned at the guys that are standing there and will, and will punch with them. Some good body shots in there. Yeah, he landed a nice, well, it was a hard ride early, Two times. Yes. The belt one, but didn't show him. Uh, now he's more for a five one, but it was a bit early, wasn't it? Keep it. Uh, the ref didn't pick up, but uh, Ibi took a well. He seems a lot more comfortable at featherweight as well, Ibi. Even moving up to a junior live, I would say, you know, he would still be strong, I think. Found it very hard to make that weight to kick it down to super bantam weight, um, you know, and struggled a little bit with that. Um, you know, as you know, young man, he's, you know, his body's developed and he's grown. It's, it's hard to try and stay at the same weight. I think it's a good decision for the trainers to move him up a weight he's more comfortable in. So, you know, beautiful body work there from your Bella. Yeah, one back to the body from What a left, left, rip rip, from left rip into the body, yeah. Grazing right from uh, but uh, didn't trouble Bala at all. Wild ride from Ibi there. Wasn't a bit uh, over anxious or over ambitious. Right dig to the body from Bouton. Ten seconds. with your best shot, three. If his father, Nuri, in the corner, and Uncle Mito, who was, uh, you know, a Victorian featherweight champion, and a, a right. rated beat uh, Guinea Hillier. Back in my day. Yeah, 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 yeah. back in here, though, great, yeah. Yeah. Remember that fight? So, those, yeah, very, very tough family, the Ballas. I don't, I don't think any of them can't fight. I, I wouldn't fight one of their bloody goats, mate. <laughs> On the same yeah, card the as Matt, both the amateurs <laughs> and the pros. Yes, no, they're always tough boys. Yeah, so that's it's a little body. bit of, that's a little bit of smart there from Ibrahim Bella, you know. He he took that shot, he saw the opportunity, but he wasn't quite right. There's the nice yeah. sweet left hook. And that's nice to see him taking that time and balance, picking his shot, starting to show some experience there, you know, within the pros. When you start bowling them all over, it's easy to keep yeah. that rolling and, and sometimes you know a loss in your record makes you think about that and your safety and, and looking after your chin and look yeah, okay yeah, let's yeah. not take unnecessary risks and yeah. uh, you bang them home when, when, when they're on. Dead right Brian. And notice uh, his, his defence against the left foot improved markedly. Uh, he certainly has. Is there a little nick on Puton's left eye? There, yeah. He's tough. He's come to fight. Yeah, yeah. This is a little, little, little 
little bit airclassed in the boxing department, but not when it comes to having a row. He'll stand there and trade. Okay. Here we are on Combat Sports. Live.com.au. All around Australia. Lovely Steer, good, jab. Stiff left hand. With me is Graham Bomber Murray, former Australian light heavyweight champion. Super middleweight, well, weren't they called light heavyweights back in the day? What was the diff? Uh, no, well, back in the day, originally they didn't have super middleweights. You jumped straight up from middleweight at 72 and a half to light heavyweight. To light heavyweight, that's right. Then they brought in super middle at 76, and I could actually fight both my own size for a change. Okay, I remember watching you fight at Hungarian Centre one night. Well, that was in my, my yeah, my Lad latter years. My doddering years. That was light heavyweight. Nice hands from good left, Ibrahim good Bala. Good hand work from Ibrahim Bala. Bring it on, says Virgil Puton. Oh, chopping. That second one had a bit of pop on it. Ten too. seconds. Yes, yeah, so that's what I mean about Ibrahim. Instead of instead of charging back in, La Bala's yeah. learning to box and get out and move. I didn't like that. I'm not going to get hit again. I'll move. Yeah. You know, wins the round. Round three. You know, when well, that's right. But, you know, instead of walking back in and slugging when he when he when he's when he's got a little bit ridiculous on the chin, he's covering up and doing the right thing, smart work. Uh, a nice boy Putin to versus Bala. How about that? Is Virgil Puton. to see more of that from from Ivy sticking that jab out Sid Bella puts on throws two lands one just grazing jab <coughs> he does <laughs> oh nice, nice missed with right that right hand. hand he's trying to draw him into a fight this is where it be this is where Bella's got to be clever and smart here now Not, not get sucked in it. Come on, let's have a row. Yeah, nice jab there from uh, Puton. Good body shot from Puton. <laughs> Referee Nations Mizzalace warning Ibrahim Bella for holding. Also Puton for pulling the head down. Referee in charge of the game. Nice little right hand from Puton and a body shot. One straight back from Ibrahim Bella. One, two. Just graze the mark. Left hook from uh, And a couple right of body shots and a little right right hook. He's gaining in confidence this round, Puton, Graham. Yeah. Nice hooks, nice turning from Ibrahim Bella. He's got a bit of a mouse under that left eye, Ibrahim has. Don't know if that's from a punch or a head close, Graham. No, yeah, they've been, uh, the heads have been coming pretty yeah, I think he liked, you know, he'd like to stop. He's, he's not going to go hunting for it. He, he's yeah. looking for the win and getting the, and the rounds and get the distance. That's it. Get back, that, get back up in that title chase. And like you said, the Tabaneo fight, you know, was probably something that, that you know made him, you know, rethink and recheck it. Nice, nice right work. Hand. That was a chomping little yeah, right even, hand. Even gets an acknowledgement there from Puton, a bit of a nod as he went back there. Boxing as well as I've seen him tonight. Ten Bella. seconds. Yep. I'd like to see him get the end swell on that little before it opens up. He's got that little leg sitting on his left cheekbone there. Yep. Hope they get That's on that. That's round four. Yeah, I think the blood start might have started to come from him. Here 
Here we go, round five. Yeah. I tell you what, every time he, he looks like he hurts Poudon, he comes straight back with something. Oh, nice that was a nice. Well. There we go again, you know. Um, He's got a good chin, Poudon. There's a left hook. He certainly Bala. does. A nice solid right to the body from Poudon. Good work from go. both boys. Yeah, good left hand work. Nice short right into the body, and again there from Poudon. Body shots from both boxes in that last exchange. Nice short right from uh, Puton. Yeah, good exchange for him that one. He'd be fighting from the Southpaw stance. Yeah. La Bella, Ibrahim Bella. Out of Jekka boxing. Sometimes I, I don't know whether it's a ploy where um, Puton wants him to jump in, but after there's a little bit of a break in the traffic. He stands back and open the hands out, and uh, you know I, I certainly know a younger Ibrahim Bella would have jumped straight at it. Um, it's a challenge, uh, That's right. but it's you know like I said, he, you know he's boxing smarter, and you know he's using his experience now. Nice left grip from Bella, and a left hook to follow it up, and nice footwork to get out of trouble there. Hope you're all enjoying the fights back home. Sitting on the couch, having a couple of cold ones. I know it's a bit late for St. Paddy's Day, but depends where you are in the world. If, uh, nice left hand work from both boxes there. That's it. If you're on the other side of the world, you're sitting over there in uh, California somewhere, and you're up late, it's uh, sort of still St. Patrick's Day. Nice body shot from Puton. And a missing right hand. Good footwork from Ibrahim Bella. You know, it's, it's a good test for... Ibrahim Bell. You know, this guy's come to fight. He's come to fight. He's got a good, good kick in his punch and he's got a good Oh, chin. that was nice. No, I think the body was, shot was the better of the two of that. That should have been a straight shot. I think he knows that. Put himself off balance. Yeah. Ten seconds. Ten to go in the fifth round. Round seconds out as we approach round six. We come to the halfway point of ten rounds of boxing. Okay, into the second half of the bout now. Virgil Putin. from the Philippines. Slips, no go. Jimaholic and Virgil Puton. Nice right lead from Bala. 
Dodger boy, six back and those guns, mate, I'd say he is a Jim Oli. Oh, good left hook from uh, left hook. from Pouton. Well, back to jabbing. That's the way he's going to do it, mate. Nice oh, little boy would have just wanted to slug it out. Yep. Nice to see. Good work. Slip again, yeah. Yeah, like I said, it's a bit of a river yep. flow. You, you picked it, Brian, yeah. yeah. It's a bit of a river. Yeah. It still looks like the river no dam. Too much water, far too much water. Ten seconds. Pouton brings his feet together. That's when he's vulnerable. Yep. And he does that when he overextends with the right. He goes well for round six. Round six. Go in the book, as they say, in the book. It's always possible, they've both got plenty of kick in their fist, but um, both, bo both boys have been hit on the chin a couple of times, and uh, yep. Nice shot that look there from Bala, off the wrong foot. Take this opportunity, big shout out to the sponsors tonight. Southpaw jab there from Bala, inside left and up right uppercut. Put his jaws together, uh, Virgil put on. Ten seconds. Round seven. Good stuff. Oh, 
Nigel. He just right missed that top. right over the top of the head there. But I'm loving the way he's switching and he's realising when he's making a little mistake and he's getting out of the way of them bombs. Because, whoa, whoa! Left hand and then the left rip from, uh, oh, bombs. That was low Pouton, from yeah. Pouton. Yeah. Definitely low. Referee Nasus Middle of Mr. Ludis didn't pick that one up. Yeah. Pouton's having a crack yeah. now. He knows he's, he's behind. He's, he's coming after uh, Bala. Bala, though, doesn't go with him. He ties him up. That's the ref break. He goes back to center ring. Good work from uh, Bala. He's had his jab. Yeah, just a mention from Ivy and Bella telling him to watch his heads. They're both a little guilty of that. Um, but, you know, one thing a prospect fighter doesn't want to get, and that's cuts. I mean, you know, you get further up in your career. No! Oh, left hook on right hand. Bombs! Yeah, that's brought a big acknowledgement. That's a Pouton. couple of big punches. And a good and what does, in the body to go on with. And what does Pouton do? Bring it on, he says. Yep. Couple of big punches there from... Labala. Working the jab to keep working the jab. I'm loving the way he's boxing. He's putting his power shots in. They're not working. He's getting out, switching from lefty to right. He's using his footwork. Boxing really nice. Nice left lead there from the there you go. Stands. Left hook back from Puton. Yeah, watch the heads. Referee Nace warning Ibrahim for, for bringing up the head. Um, not that Puton hasn't been guilty of it himself. Good nice left hook, left hook yes. Works the left again, but quite a defence there from Puton. the body from Oh, sharp little left hook. Felt that one too, the little fella. There we go. Look at that footwork. Nice work from Bella. Ten seconds. Nice Ten to right go. Here. Let's get it on. That hurt. He, I think he's willing himself on there. That had to have some popping at that hook. That's well. Very, very, right. nice. very good chin, uh, Virgil Pouton. Very, very, very... Wobbly on his legs, walking back to the corner then. Um, Graham will be able to get up and interview them, so that was fantastic as well. Here we go, Here into we the go. last two rounds. No, we have a bit of a timeout. Yeah, look, That's I mean, I think they're using the timeout, mate. They're, they're waxing yep. that. Yep. You know, let's, let's how, how does the water get three feet away from the corner? <laughs> yeah. You know, what's he squirting it with the bottle? Second jab of a double gets through from Bella. Nice footwork, boxing smart. Yeah, he looks like he's got a cut in the top of the head. He bring him Bella some blood dripping down oh, the back yeah. of his ear. Yeah, not the dangerous spot though, so. No, but that's obvious of the. They look, look how close good, them heads good are getting. Body work and oh, good left hook, left the hook head from, from uh, Puton. Puton. And he was lucky. Bella's he was getting up on his toes now. Right, right above us here. Good work from both boys. Ooh, shot, shot, oh, they're banging, they're banging away here. Yeah. They're banging away. That's more Bella on the move. Plenty of lateral movement there. Going to South Ball, tying up. Good defensive work. Switches so, to South Ball and where's the right hand down yeah, the pipe? Nice, nice right hand from. Um, Ooh, that body shot over the sting on too, that right hook from Puton. Jab the body from Bala. Hand speed from Ibrahim Bala. Oh, nice little uppercut yeah, yeah. there. Right underneath there from Puton. And another well. one too. Short left hook to the head. Misses with the right, falls to hands and knees. Yep. Big victim of his own corner water, mate. <laughs> he's look, he's got he's got water dripping all over him. 
I know it's it's not that hot and naughty. I don't think yeah, it's, it's sweeter. Really it's short, it's, it's just, you know, saturating him. It's saturating him in the corner with the water. But he's come to win. He's having a crack this kid and he can bang. He's always just one punch away from victory. I'm sure that's how they see it. The referee moving him away from the water. Nice work from Ibrahim Bala. Yeah, very ambitious, ambitious right overhand. Yeah, I read my read, yeah, read my mind there, Graham. Oh, oh what a little left, left hook. Short left off the south poor stand from Ibrahim Bella. Fast hands from Ibrahim Bella. Three, yeah. Good stuff. Swing and look. Ten seconds. This is where he might catch Poots on with the good one here. If you can get him falling, falling into those shots, yeah. he might land the one that finishes it. Look at that. Beautiful. That's the bell round nine. Last round he coming was. up. He's got a tendency when he throws that Let's right get hand, involved. That when he throws that right hand, he'll bring that back foot forward. Yeah. One for the and money, two for the show. Square, which leads him off balance. Ready to get ready. Go, Cat, go. Last round coming up. Tenth and final. Touch gloves. Here we go. That's right, yeah, he hasn't uh, absolutely thrashed, he's won every round just about, but he hasn't thrashed him in those rounds. No, he's had to work for those rounds, definitely. Yeah. And he worked well, like a little foot movement like that, so. Yeah, and he, took, he wore a couple on the chin early on and uh, weathered the storm, so it's a, it's a good sign from Bubba. He's right, they're both doing it, they're both dropping their heads in. Yeah. Right Good hand right hand from Pouton. He knows he's got to knock him out, I think. Jab, jab, jab from uh, Bala. Left hook from both Toe to toe, the boys Another here. Left hook from Bala. Watch the heads. Right hand body hand shots from Pouton. He won't right go right away. Again. Left hook from Bala. Left rip from Bala. If he wants to finish it. No quitting poots on. Come on, he says. Center ring. Right into the body from That was a good shot from poots on. while we get the action from there from Balor. I think that was a good shot to the body. Yep. Nice sharp left hook, counter left rip from Pouton. Both boys banging. Come on, the crowd should be getting up beyond this one. You know, these guys are whacking each other. No, he's not cut, don't worry about it. Focus on the job, son. Focus on the job. Doesn't need to be in there, Graham. No, no, and they're banging heads again too. They are. Are we starting to feel the pinch a bit? Final 30 seconds of the fight. That knockout, son. Almost up. throwing caution for the win for a moment. He there, is, Bala. especially in that soaking wet Ten corner. seconds. Ten to go. From Bala. Strong finish from Ibrahim Bala. What a rib racing last round. How about Set that? We go to the score totals. Bartolo Scafetti had it. 100 to 90. Lynn Kennedy had it closer, 97-93. Replicated by Paul Lee, 97-93. Unanimous points winner, red corner, Ibrahim Bala.
Well done, Howard. Yeah, great call. Congratulations, Lynn. Uh, congratulations. I'd like to obviously uh, the Virgil Puton's left the ring, but everyone, please give Virgil Puton what a what a great fight. The man came to fight. He didn't come. He, he came to he came to try and win, and he gave it his best. Best shot. You know, tough boy. Um, he'd be back in the winning circle, mate. Must feel good. It was really nice to see. We're sitting down there commentating the fight and to see at times I knew when you would have let the wild instincts go and, uh, and start trading. But, you know, he caught you with a couple of shots and it was really nice to see you slipping and sliding, and moving and using your boxing ability to get out of trouble and then, and then pick another time to land your own shots. Yeah, uh, first of all, being back in the winning circle feels familiar. Uh, feels like home. Um, he was an awkward customer. Uh, he he um, tried to draw me up into a war, and um, the plan was to keep him at distance, draw him, draw him in into the fight. So I think we um, capitalised on that. Just uh, he's, got, he's got a tough head, man. Credit to Virgil and commiserations to him. Um, I'd just like to thank uh, my sponsors, first of all. Uh, sorry, my trainer, Lim Jacker, my strength coach, <laughs> Dirk Lamb, my dad, my uncle, Signature, Constructions, virus, um, Sting Sports. I'd like to thank everyone out here that comes to support me and everyone else that comes to support boxing. Thank you guys very much. You guys are keeping boxing alive and um, every fighter appreciates it very much. Thank you guys. Okay, um, just like to talk to you, Coach Slim. Uh, uh, how was it, mate? The, the, the great trip to I go over the Philippines. It's, uh, it's quite an amazing. It, it's a bit of a change over there and uh, did you find that that helped you in preparation with the boys this, this time? Yeah, uh, look, it's in, in Australia, it's very hard with a lot of weights to get, you know, steady and uh, different competitions. So it was great that we got the opportunity to go over there and, and work with some of the, um, you know, one of the best gyms in the Philippines. So it was a good experience for the boys. Uh, they were very, very good to us. You know, we enjoyed our whole time there. And uh, it really, it, we came back fit and, and focused with what we needed to do. And, and tonight we got the job done. You know, as an awkward customer, that guy's well travelled. You know, he's got his his record is a lot better than what people think. I mean, he's, you know, and he could bang. And yeah, he, he could. He, he wasn't he wasn't a soft touch. So that's what we wanted. We wanted somebody that hasn't been stopped. We wanted somebody that came here to fight. And that's what that guy did. And we got a good ten round hit out. And we're back. We're back on top. And uh, we're as good as our last fight, and we're getting better and better. I and mean, we're working our way up that ladder, and very soon you're going to see us in that top 10 in the world and looking for that top spot and that chance for a world title. And uh, we can't get there without you guys and without your support and the support of all our sponsors and the people that, that follow us. We really appreciate your help, your following. We love you all. We really appreciate you, and uh, we're looking forward to, to our future. Thank you very much, guys. And, and to all, and all the fans back home watching on live, CombatSports.com. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, look forward to my big brother putting on a better show in the main event. Okay, Camille Bell coming up after Jade Mitchell, Les Sherrington. Stay tuned. And Lyndon Hoskins is a man. He's our man. Tim Bella back at the Melbourne Good on you, Troy. Thanks Park for Function us. Centre. Against tough puncher Virgil Puton. Yep, 16 wins, 7, there was a nice jab from Bala. 16 wins, 7 losses. Better south of the Turk in the west. KO, so he can, got a bit of kick in his fist as well. Yeah. Just a nice, uh, just that uh, both Ibrahim and uh, Camille Bala have been over training at Allah Gym. Uh, if they're watching the link over there, uh, Sir Allah, Dido Edmund and all the boys at Allah Gym, hello from Melbourne, Australia. Um, here we are, La Bala, Ibrahim Bala. Nice left hand against Puton there. He tipped the scales last night at 57 kilograms even. As I said, 27 years of age, 23 fights, 16 wins, seven losses. Would you welcome a man with the same name as the Russian president? No connection there. Virgil Putin with gold and red trunks. And across the ring in the red corner with a great Yarraville following here tonight. Working out with former national champ, Lim Jecker in High Street, Yarraville. 11 fights, 10 wins, only one loss. London Olympian 2012. 
has held Australian Super Bantamweight and Featherweight Championships. Part of a great fighting family, ladies and gentlemen. Good to see Ben Damon here, Ben Damon, boxing commentator, KO Boxing on Fox Sports, racing crown bet. Both fighters weighed in right on the featherweight limit, 57 kilograms even. 10 by 3 minute rounds of international boxing in the featherweight division. Would you welcome in the blue corner from Montin Lupa, Metro Manila in the Philippines. Coach Dante Santos El Mario. Oh, a nice left hook there from Puton. He's got to watch that Gibi Bella. Bella. Got to watch that left hook Gibi Bella. That's correct. Good jab again from him. Nice right 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 uh, oh, good left hook from Bala. Nice Nice rip to the body from Puton, but what a left hook back from Bala, yes. Right into the body nice. from uh, Puton, left hook to the head from Bala. Nice oh. chopping right there from uh, Puton. Puton's right hand did a bit of damage there, I think. He's got yeah. that's better to see Ibrahim, Ibrahim there. Using his defensive gentlemen wearing black trunks with sponsors names. Would you welcome La Bala Ibrahim Bala? Your referee, Ignatius Missilatus. Ten rounds of boxing international. Here we go. Here we go. Round one. What a cracker. La Bella. 